I'm gonna do a body tutorial. Isn't that funny? It's kind of funky though. Okay. My face is already done, but I left out some things that I'm going to show you guys how to do. My first step, of course, is to scrunch my hair just a little bit. Fix it, you know, whatever you decide to do. Barbie's fun, so have fun with it. I put a pink neon bow in my hair, which I think is so cute. And I found a pink t-shirt. And I have my simple pink diamond earring. So today the makeup that I um, decided to use, if you guys can tell, I look a little bit darker. Um, I was inspired by this Michelle Barbie, which I just loaded a video about it. Um, I'm using CoverGirl Exact Radiance. And my color is Soft Sable. So with this, if you've never used it before, it's very, you can see that it's, it's running. Um, it's pretty runny and you just basically take your wedge, apply to whatever areas you need to, smooth it out all over, like so, and you know, keep it moving. Make sure you keep your top on this like really tight, um, cause if this stuff spills out in your makeup kit, it's gonna cause a humongous mess. Um, my next step was to basically, here's a color palette of, gosh, why does the color look crappy on my computer? Okay, but your color palette of, uh, dark purple, light pink, whatever. So what I did was I started here and I just build and just add, just keep it, make it, make it darker in that area. Same thing on both eyes. This is a very um, beautiful pink color. Um, also, on the base of the eye, you just take a white opaque, um, like this. This is very white. And you just take it before you actually put your pink on. And as you can see, it's almost like I have a highlighted eye. It just adds a little bit more dimension and depth to the eye as well. Um, then above the eye, this is a glitter, glitter pink. I put that here. Um, you can see how much of a difference that just made to my eye. It's like, hello, beautiful eyes are here. Look at me. Okay. And then just to add some, some, a little bit more depth or just contour to the eye, I took my CoverGirl dark plum which I really like this color it's almost better than black and you put here in your crease in the crease of your eye and you just smooth it you can see that direction I'm going in like that you just work it with your fingertips and that's all you pretty much need there um, on your eye um, I highly recommend um, taking a little bit of your white and doing like so in between your eye. It opens the eye and it makes you look refreshed. Like look at this eye. You add all that white. I'm awake. I'm asleep. I'm awake. I'm asleep. So you just pretty much add it. Smooth it out. And if you add too much, um, just take your wedge and Smooth it back into your skin. You won't even notice it. Okay. Um, my next step was... Where did my eyeliner go? I take my Rimmel London eyeliner. And you basically just go from this corner to this corner. Just line it really light. Doesn't have to be too, too heavy. Because remember, Barbie... Um, is about makeup but you don't have to like go like overboard with it okay take your black eyeliner um, this is Maybelline it's just black and I'm going to right in my face because I'm going to try to line my eyes 
from the mirror that's in my bathroom and this mirror. So you just basically go here and you line it and remember to go right as I call this the booger line because we all have boogers in our eyes every now and then. Um, you do the same exact treatment for the other eye. And I used just a little bit of bronzer today on my face. Um, Barbie's usually kind of sun-kissed. So take it. You want to start here in the middle of your nose. And, of course, just smooth it out all over. All over. Now you look like you've just been kissed by the sun. Okay. I like doing these tutorials. They're very fun. Um, take a little bit of mascara, which you guys know I use last, um, last a little. And I normally just take and pull and just go up. Pull and go up. That's it. Okay. Now, I normally, like I'm going to do today, I take a brown um, eye pencil and I just fill in my eyebrows. Barbie has a very um, prominent eyebrow, um, so you just basically fill yours in, smooth it out, make it look a little bit, you know, more precise, like so. And for Barbie's lips, I use oh, here it is. just a light um, lip gloss. This is Donna Michelle. And this is scented plum. And then also, before I actually put my gloss on, this is my actual eye color. My, excuse me, lip color. You go here. I call these my mountains. Why? Because I have a mountain there. You can see it. Go on the lip, under the bottom of the lip. And you take your Donna Michelle. You can just pat it on your lips and it just adds an extra glossy shine to your face and to your lips. Now this is a fun little thing that um, this is clear lip gloss. Now be very careful doing this. You just take little dabs, just put it on your face now this I'm just like a little funky Barbie. You know, just have a little fun. And then, dun, 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 take your glitter. Regular glitter you buy from the dollar store. Or there is makeup glitter, but I'm just using what I have in my kit today. Take your finger and like so. And touch your face ever so gently with the glitter. You just want to... You just add in a little accent and really to be honest with you when you're doing this you might want to close your eye as many of you know uh, glitter does cut so and then it's just something fun I look like a little fairy princess I think and that is the look um, inspired by Barbie so if you like this look and other looks, let me know. And I'm going to do another tutorial today on purple. Um, purple is like one of my favorite colors. And actually, this is a cream squish tube. You guys are going to see. I'm going to do like a purple eye or a green eye, whatever. I'm just going to concentrate on the eyes. I'm not going to do anything with the lips. Um, and actually, I'm going to keep my eyeliner on. So it will be easier to go through the tutorial. So... This is my Barbie look. I'm all glammed out. And I hope you guys like it and enjoy. And uh, remember to be a different Barbie. Don't always be the Barbie that other people want you to be. So hope you enjoyed this tutorial. This is Big Barbie out.